Nice work, champ. We've got to look our best for Great Uncle Busby's lunch. He hates mess. Trust me. Oh? Hmm. Oh. <laughs> now let's get going, or we'll be late. And Buster? <laughs> uh, yeah? Stay away <gasps> from those muddy puddles. Hmm. To use the car wash again. <laughs> I'm clean, let's go. Hey. <laughs> oh I'm so excited to see Great Uncle Busby. He always has such tasty lunches. Chips and sandwiches and cheese sticks. Mmm! That's right, Buster. And carrot cake and steam buns and lemonade. Do you think he'll have blueberry muffins again? Do you, Daddy? Do you? I hope so. And peanut butter and ice cream and... Oh. Huh? Oh. Sorry! Hmm. Car wash again? <laughs> Hurry up! We're gonna be late! <laughs> come on, Daddy! I'll race you! Oh, yeah? Here I come! <laughs> Kate! <gasps> Whoa! Oh, <gasps> oh steaming gaskets! Any moment. <laughs> we made it just in time. Well done, Buster. Thanks, Daddy. Okay. Let's go see Uncle Busby. <laughs> Sorry. <Huh>? <laughs> Daddy, hmm? I think you need to use the car wash. <laughs> the truth, Bandit. It's important to own up to your mistakes, uh. even if it was an accident. 
No, it was me who drove over Ash's painting. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to. I was just driving too fast. I didn't see it. Buster, why didn't you say anything? Because I was afraid what you'd all think. I'm really sorry, Bandit. I didn't mean for you to get in trouble. I was just scared. That's okay. I forgive you. (laughs) That's very kind of you, Bandit. Buster, it's not an easy thing to own up to our mistakes. You did a very brave thing admitting the truth. (laughs) Well done. Now, if you all gather round, I've got an idea of how we can make Ash's painting as good as new. (laughs) Your turn, Ash, with orange. (laughs) Yellow, green, blue. That's it, everyone. It's a rainbow. You can't even see the tyre mark. Wow! It's better than before! (laughs) Buster, what are you doing? We are going to use this dress-up box to put on a play! (laughs) This play is going to be about pirates and I'm going to be Captain Busterbeard. Yar! This will be so much fun. I can do my juggling trick. Uh, maybe, so long as it's piratey. And I want to sing this new song I made up. It goes like this. Who's the big bus? Oh, yeah. Uh, I'm bandit. Big bus. Pirates oh, yeah. don't sing. My pirate does. I can have lots of tentacles, <laughs> like giant squids. <laughs> A giant squid, Ash. You'll be great. Come on, guys, let's go. There's so much to do. (laughs) I'm actually more into tractor jazz. We're ready. Yar! This is the story of Captain Busterbeard. (laughs) I'm the bravest pirate in the whole wide world. And I'm his best friend, the juggling pirate! (laughs) Look, what's that? It's another pirate! Not just any pirate, Mm -hmm. it is I, Bandit Beard the Singing Pirate! Bandit? Oh no, who's the big bus? Oh yeah, I'm the big bus, oh yeah, I'm a super fast bus and I zoom zoom zoom. I'm the speediest bus in the room, room, room. It's me, the giant skid. <laughs> Who's the big bar? Oh, this is a disaster. What are you talking about? The audience love it. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> Come on, Ash. Time for the big finish. I'm too nervous. I'll do it wrong. You can do it, Ash. We're here to have fun. I don't want to do the play without you. I am the giant skid. Squid. I am the giant squid. Look at all my tentacles. (laughs) (laughs) <laughs> Whoa! We're the big bus! <laughs> <laughs> Whoa! That was great fun, Buster! Yeah, it was! <laughs> Space. This is our solar system. Space is so cool. I brought my alien today. This is Mercury, the orange planet, Neptune, the blue planet, and Saturn, the yellow planet, with a ring. And this is Mars, the red planet. It's our nearest neighbor. I want to go to Mars. (laughs) Good for you, Buster. Reach for the stars. The first bus to put wheels on Mars. 
<laughs> Watch out for those asteroids, Buster! Uh, oh. Oh. <laughs> Space is awesome! I wish we could go up there! It's Super Buster! Flying through space like a rocket! And Speedy Scout! Zooming across the universe like a... Um, <laughs> car! Come on, let's explore space! What's up, little alien dude? Oh, gee. That's a real sad story. Wait, you can understand what he's saying? Of course. Alien says they're lost, so we need to help them find their way home. To Mars! The Red Planet. You got it, Scout. Let's go! <laughs> Not this one. The blue planet is Neptune. Blue, blue. That's Neptune in alien language. I was an alien, I would live here. Woohoo! <laughs> this is Saturn. Bloop, bloop. Yeah, that's what I said. Look out, Scout! Asteroids up ahead! Hang on, little buddy. This could get bumpy! <gasps> <Ooh. laughs> Woohoo! Go away, Alien! Mars, the red planet. Blue, blue, blue. We made it. There's your home. <laughs> blue, blue, blue. <laughs> that was fun. <laughs> It's wobbly, and it feels weird. Oh, Buster, the tooth will fall out on its own. But when? Uh... Soon. And when it does fall out, if you put it under your pillow, the tooth fairy will bring a coin. A gold coin? Uh, sure. You just have to be patient. <laughs> Soon. I just need to be patient. Uh, Buster? And when I put it under my pillow, the Tooth Fairy will bring a gold coin. Buster. Hmm. I wonder what she needs the teeth for. Buster! What? Your tooth! It's already gone! Huh? <gasps> no! My tooth! It's gone! When did you last have it? I don't remember. It could be anywhere. And if I can't find it, I can't put it under my pillow. This is so bad! Wait, Buster. We can find it ourselves! You mean, like detectives? That's right, Detective Buster. The case of the missing tooth! Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> nope. I haven't seen your missing tooth. Are you sure? I'm sure. Super duper turbo sure. Then what's that? Huh? Huh? Relax, Speedy. It's just my mint-tasting bubble gum. Huh? A tooth? Yeah, I've seen a tooth. You have? <laughs> sure! <laughs> Look! <laughs> <sighs> Detective Buster! Look! Hmm? Ha! <laughs> uh. huh? huh? Wait, this isn't a tooth. You found my eraser! Hooray! I'm sorry, Buster. Guess we'll never solve the case. I found my tooth! It must have fallen out when I bumped the gate this morning! 
Hooray! The case is solved! Nice one, Buster! <laughs> Uh, time's up! I'm really looking forward to seeing all of your science projects. Uh, I will start off with the rainbow water experiment. Uh, but wait, what are we all missing, class? Uh, I miss huh? my mum! <laughs> uh, goggles? That's right, Buster! Goggles! <laughs> Whoa! What is it? Uh, that's my lunch buster. Hmm, this isn't rainbow coloured. Well, I look forward to seeing your experiments after break time. Hopefully with more success than mine. <laughs> Whoa, your rocket looks super cool, Bandit. I know. Your volcano is pretty cool too, I guess. When I pour this vinegar into the volcano, it will erupt! Uh-oh! Uh My electric rocket! Oh! <gasps> the rocket is so powerful! It's taking the lunch to outer space! Hmm, those batteries did look quite big. After that rocket! I'll get it, Buster! Look out! It's Speedy Scout! Huh? <laughs> <Yay>. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Bandit, jump on your side when I say go! Ready? Are you sure about this? No? Sorry, I thought you said go. That's not good. Uh. Oh. <laughs> Whew. Uh, Buster! <gasps> Quick! We need to block the crater! The sun! Ash! That was close. <gasps> that was amazing! Whose project was that? Uh, everyone's. We did it together. But you'll have to clean it up, I'm afraid. And I'm going to eat my sandwich. Hmm, I don't really like rocket in my sandwiches. When you grow up, each of you will have a part to play in the community. Dream big! What will you be? You could be a firefighter, a doctor, or best of all, a teacher like me! <laughs> or you could be a race car and take part in all the big high-speed races. There's so much we could be! A firefighter? A space explorer? I want to be a... 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 Lighthouse! What about you, Scout? I want to be a race car! Speedy Scout! Winner of the big race! That's awesome, Scout! I bet you'll be the fastest race car in history! And I'm going to be the race talk guy! It's Speedy Scout, ready for the big <laughs> race! And there's her helper! Buster! Here's the world champion, the most awesomest race car in the whole world. It's Chase Octane, the turbo car! You can do it, Scout! Ready, steady, go, 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 go! <laughs> can you hear me, Scout? Loud and clear! Quick! Take that right turn. It's a shortcut. No, that's a left turn. My bad. Woohoo! I'm faster than a rocket. Huh? Oh no, Buster! I have a flat tire. Don't worry, Scout. I'm coming. Sorry. Excuse me. Sorry. Pardon. Ah! Ah! Buster. 
monster? Mm, I got a tire! <laughs> it's too late. I'll never catch Octane. Sure you can. If anyone can catch him, it's Speedy Scout. Mm. with heights. Hmm. Come with me. Professor Excavator has a cunning plan. <laughs> Behold, my greatest invention yet, the Excavator Turbo Flyer. Uh, Diggly? Professor Excavator. Sorry, Professor Excavator. Uh, this is a trailer? That won't fly, not in a million, billion, trillion years. But this isn't just a trailer, it's a big, balloon-powered cloud bouncer. <gasps> ah! <laughs> 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 Burned it! Whoa! Hmm? These balloons are cool. We should fill them with water and have a water fight! Leave them, Bandit! We're trying to fly! But I'm Super Buster. Super Buster isn't afraid of heights. Get me down! I don't like heights! Buster, help! How do we get down? Uh, <laughs> I didn't think of that. Uh, <laughs> we'll think of something. Just don't look down. 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 Ah! I look down! By my calculations, they could blow all the way into space. Uh, we can do this with a bumper bunch. Aha! Buster, catch! Ooh, aha! Ah! Bandit, pop some balloons. I'm scared. I can't move. You can be brave, Bandit. You can do it. We both can. Ah! Ah! <laughs> Stand back! Stand back! Turbo Flyer coming into land! <laughs> Whoa! That, that was fun! We faced our fears. That's awesome! And it turns out, buses can fly. Mommy Bus and Ashley are having a relaxing day in, while Buster and Ash play tag. Oops, watch out, Buster. Hmm, maybe Buster and Ash should play outside instead. Wow, look at all that snow. What should they play? Oh, Buster knows a good game. How about cops and robbers? Ash can be the cop, and Buster can be the robber. Grandpa Bus is struggling to turn that hose on. Can Ash catch Buster? Oops, nearly. Oh, watch out, Grandpa. 
The hose is spraying water all over the shed. It's a bit hard to control. Oh, look! Buster has spotted the shed as a good hiding place. Off he goes, with Ash not far behind. Ash got him! Well done! Oh, no! The water on the shed is freezing into icicles. They're trapped! Buster and Ash are honking their horns for help, but no one can hear them. What else can they try? Oh, Buster has a new idea. Buster is trying to push Ash through the window, but he doesn't quite fit. Oh, there's Grandpa Bus. Quick, try to get his attention. He's seen them. But, oh dear, Grandpa Bus thinks they're just playing a game. What can they do now? Oh, a fishing rod. Buster has an idea. Grandpa Bus is really looking forward to eating his sandwich. But, oh no, it's snatched away. Buster is using the fishing rod to hook the sandwich and get Mommy Bus's attention. Go, Buster! Huh? It worked! Mommy Bus has spotted them. Hmm. Mommy Bus to the rescue. What's she got there? <laughs> ah, Mommy Bus is using a hairdryer to melt the icicles. What a good idea! <laughs> but they're melting very slowly. <laughs> hmm, this could take a while. Hmm. She's determined hmm. it will work. Nearly there. <laughs> Buster and Ash are free at last. Thanks, Mommy. And everything is back to normal. It's a sunny day at Buster's house. Oh, look! Mommy Bus is helping a kitten with a sore leg. There, all fixed and bandaged up. <laughs> Scout is here to drive to school with Buster. They are playing in the playground. Oh dear! Scout hurt her tire. Buster's got an idea. What is he up to? He's bandaged up Scout's tire with toilet roll. All fixed! Great work, Buster! Looks like Ash wants to be bandaged up as well. And now Scout wants her other tires bandaged up. But Buster is all out of toilet roll. Bandit has a cheeky idea. They're all taking the toilet roll. They're getting the toilet roll everywhere. This looks very messy. They're getting a bit carried away. Oh dear, they've covered the playground in toilet roll. Teacher doesn't seem very pleased. Mommy Bus is here to take Buster home. She wonders what has upset the teacher. Buster explains he was trying to help Scout like Mommy helped the kitten. Mommy will be able to bandage it properly. Time to get properly fixed up. Buster and his friends are back at school. They are telling each other what they got up to over the summer. Buster is so excited to tell everyone about his shark tooth. But first, Scout is telling everyone what she got up to over the summer. This summer, I went surfing for the first time ever. It was so cool. There was this one wave I saw that was absolutely massive. But I still got to surf it without falling off. And I went so fast. Scoot, scoot. Wow, Scout told such a cool story. What's wrong with Buster? Mm. 
Oh, he thinks his shark tooth story won't be interesting enough after Scout's story. Hmm. Ah. Buster is going to tell everyone how he got the tooth. This summer, I went exploring in the deep, dark wood. <laughs> it's full of animals and monsters, but I wasn't afraid one bit. <laughs> But then, I came face to face with a dinosaur. <gasps> but he had a sore tooth. So I took it out for him to make him feel all better. Wait a second, that's not right. Dinosaurs are extinct. Oh dear, Bandit thinks Buster isn't telling the truth. He couldn't really meet a dinosaur, could he? Oh. <sighs> All right. It's not really a dinosaur tooth. Mm. It's a shark tooth. I thought that wouldn't be mm. interesting enough. But Buster, sharks are way cooler than dinosaurs. Go Buster, tell us the story. <laughs> this summer, I was at the beach, but then I saw, mm. no, Yes! Oh. Pirates are even cooler than sharks! <laughs> Yar, my hearties! <laughs> hmm. Okay. Ah. The pirates and me, we found a shark, but he had a sore tooth. So we decided oh. to take the tooth out with a little help from <laughs> a friendly little bee! <laughs> hmm. We took out the sore tooth and then they played catch with it! Gotcha! <laughs> and they played on the beach all day long. What a great story! It's so much fun to use your imagination, especially with friends. Buster and Scout are on their way home from school. Bye, Scout! What's Buster spotted? Oh, look! It's Diggly and Daisy! Buster wants to help. But safety first! Look at that awesome builder's hat! Buster is helping them move a crate off Rocky the Riverboat. Great teamwork, guys! Now they're placing the crate on the construction site. Mr. Rubble is off to get some lunch. See you later, Mr. Rubble! Oh, no! The crate is sinking into the mud! Go, Buster, go! Oh, no! Now Buster is stuck in the mud as well! Daisy to the rescue! Nope, that didn't work! What's that? Diggly is hooked up to that crane. And he's pulling Buster out. It's working. Just a little bit more. Oops. Now they're all stuck. And Mr. Rubble hasn't noticed. But Buster's got a plan. He's wrapping the wire around the crane and attaching it to the crate so they can pull themselves out. Brilliant idea, Buster! Diggly and Daisy are both pulling the rope at different times. But they need to work together. And that's it! Hooray! It worked! Mr. Rubble still hasn't noticed them. So they quickly pull the crate out. Everything is back to normal. <laughs> well, not quite back to normal. They're all covered in mud. It's time to get cleaned up. <laughs> Mr. Rubble is spraying them with the hose. There, that's much better. <laughs> Now it's time for a spot of lunch! Yum, yum! 
But what's that? Mr. Rubble has driven straight into the mud! <laughs> Don't worry, Mr. Rubble. They know just what to do. It's a sunny day, and Daddy Bus is taking Buster on a trip to the beach. Buster says goodbye to Mommy Bus, and off they go. Hooray! But oh dear! Otis is blocking their path. The road is closed. Buster is very upset. But looks like Daddy has an idea. It's a lovely lake. And they can go fishing instead. Buster is disappointed, though, as he wanted to go to the beach. Daddy teaches him how to fish. Wow! Now it's Buster's turn. Buster is bored. This isn't as fun as the beach. Why is Daddy so excited? Hang on, something is tugging on Daddy's line. What could it be? Whoa, Daddy has caught a huge fish. It's so big, Daddy isn't strong enough. Buster joins in and helps. Watch out, Buster. Oops, they've been pulled into the water. And the fish is finding this very funny. Buster and Daddy Bus won't give up that easily. Looks like they've got a new plan. The fish is swimming in the lake. Daddy casts his fishing line. And the fish pulls once again. It's another tug of war. Look, there's Buster floating in the lake. Aha! Gotcha! Buster caught the fish with his net! <laughs> Go, Buster! Daddy is very proud. Well done, Buster! The fish swims away. See you next time, fishy! Fishing was lots of fun after all. It's another exciting day at school for Buster and his friends. Today, they are making Mother's Day cards. Look! Teacher is showing them how to do it. Fold it in half and make a crease. Well done, Buster. But what is Bandit up to? Wow, look at all those decorations. Let's craft. Oh, Bandit, he's turned his card into a paper airplane and it's gone flying. Buster is starting with some glue. Oops, the glue is stuck to his wheel. And now there's glitter everywhere. Oh dear, Buster. The glue just won't budge. Hmm, what can Buster use to remove the glue? Aha, a spoon. Nope, that didn't work. Uh-oh, and now the spoon is stuck to his other wheel. Buster asks Scout for some help. Scout tries to pull off the glue bottle. Nope, that didn't work either. <gasps> Oh, no! Now Scout is stuck as well! Watch out, Scout! Oh, dear! This isn't going to plan! Bandit is finding all of this very funny! And the poor teacher is too distracted by Bandit's plane, he can't see what's going on! Oops! They've knocked over Ash's water! But hang on! The water has loosened the spoon! Buster has an idea! Ash is using his hose to unstick the glue. Hooray! It worked! Oh dear, what a mess! Mommy Bus is here to take Buster home. And look, Buster is giving her the special Mother's Day card. She loves it! Happy Mother's Day, Mommy Bus. Uh-oh, not again! It's time for the annual nature race, which Daddy Bus has organized. This is going to be so much fun! Ash and Buster are going to work together. They need to race through the woods as fast as they can. And the first one back gets the shiny trophy. Get set, go, go, go! Bandit has overtaken Buster and Ash. He really wants to win. What is he up to? He's changed the sign! So Buster and Ash are going the wrong way! Oh no! Huh? 
Huh? There's no more path. This can't be right. And what's that? A huge tire print. Ash thinks it must be a monster. <laughs> nope, don't worry, Ash. Monsters aren't real. Uh-oh, I think they're lost, but they need to keep going. They're slowing down. Oh dear, they're stuck in the mud. What are they going to do? <gasps> what is that? It sounds like a m monster. Ah! <laughs> ah! <laughs> Don't worry. It's just a monster truck. And they're very friendly. She's pulling Ash out of the mud. Wow, she's strong. And now it's Buster's turn. This monster truck is called Mira. She's lost too, just like them. Buster says they can work as a team. There's Naughty Bandit. He's almost at the finish line. But look! Buster and his friends are ahead. They ended up taking a shortcut. <laughs> Hooray! Mira won the race. But she couldn't have done it without her new friends. And she's won the trophy. Yippee! But Mira feels sad for Bandit being on his own. She knows what that feels like. Bandit feels bad for cheating in the big race. <laughs> Don't worry, Bandit. There's no need to cheat when you have friends by your side. And it's always fun to make new friends. It's a windy day at the park. Buster and Daddy Bus are here for a fun day out. Daddy Bus has a surprise for Buster. What could it be? Oh, look, it's a kite. Buster gets ready to fly it. Daddy Bus pushes it up into the air. Wow, it's flying so high. Well done, Buster. Look, it's Monty, the hot air balloon. Oh no, a big gust of wind has blown the kite away. It's caught on Monty and he hasn't noticed. Don't worry, Buster, Daddy has a plan. Oops! Watch out, Daddy Bus! Whoa! Great header! Go, Buster! Bandit and Ash look very confused. Where are they going? Buster is trying to get Monty's attention. But he's not looking where he's going. Watch out! Oh no! Buster has driven straight into a muddy puddle. He's stuck in the mud! Daddy heaves him out! Great teamwork, guys! Uh-oh, a tree has fallen across the road. But that won't stop them. Daddy Bus flies right over the log. And Buster slides straight underneath. Wow, that was awesome. Quick, there's Monty. Looks like Daddy Bus has an idea. There's a huge pile of mud and they're splashing through it. What are they doing? They've drawn a picture of their kite in the mud, and Monty has finally noticed the kite wrapped around him. Oops! Buster gets his kite back. Thank you, Monty. Hold tight, Buster. Phew, that was a close one. It's sports day at Buster's school. How exciting. First is the 100 meter sprint. On your marks, get set, go! Go, Buster! He's the winner! Hooray! That was easy! Buster is the fastest in school! Next up, it's the high jump! Scout's up first! Scoot, scoot! Wow! That was awesome! Buster thinks he can beat that jump! Off he goes! Oops! Don't worry, Buster. 
He doesn't look very happy. It's the egg and spoon race next. Get ready and go! Buster really wants to win. Whoops! Buster was going too fast and smashed the egg. Oh dear. And Ash is the winner. Well done, Ash. Buster is annoyed about losing. He really wanted to win. He's so upset that he isn't playing ball with the others. That does look fun, Buster. It's not just about winning, Buster. It's about having fun! Hooray! Now they're all having fun together. It's time to present the medals. Buster is third, Ash is second, and Scout is first! Well done, everyone! What a brilliant day! Look at those paint brushes! Buster and his friends are painting the walls in Buster's room today! How exciting! Mommy Bus is bringing them lots of different colored paints! They can paint the wall underneath the window! Hmm, what color should Buster choose? Scout has chosen purple! And Ash has picked red. And Buster? Yellow, of course. Let's paint. Oops. Ash adds a red splat to match Scouts. And Buster adds a yellow splat. Awesome. I wonder what Scout is painting first. It's a rocket! Awesome! Cool! Busters go next. What's he going to paint? A bumblebee! Not on the cabinet, Ash! Now they're having a paint fight. Be careful! That paint is very messy! Oh dear, they're getting paint everywhere! What a mess! Uh-oh, the yellow paint is all over the floor! And now the purple! Yikes! Mommy Bus is wondering what all that noise is. That was so much fun! Uh-oh, they didn't realize they were making such a mess! But Buster has a plan. They can use Ash's hose to clear it up. The water is washing away the paint. Great job, Ash! Oh no! Mommy Bus is coming and they haven't finished clearing up the mess yet! Time to get all cleaned up! Ash is hosing Buster down. Splash! Now it's Scout's turn. And that looks like so much fun! And finally, Ash! Well done, everyone! Wow! The room looks completely clean! Time for Ash and Scout to head off home. Oops! Well, not completely clean. Today, Buster and his family are having a picnic. Buster is so excited! Mommy Bus is off to get Grandpa. And while she's gone, Buster and Bandit need to prepare the picnic. First, they have to lay down the picnic blanket. Whoa, the wind has blown it away. It looks like a cape. It's Super Buster. Bandit wants a cape too. And it's a tug of war. 
Buster is imagining that he is a superhero. Super Buster flying through the sky. <gasps> it's bad guy Bandit. Mwahaha! He's stolen the picnic. Oh no! Super Buster has got to save it. They are chasing through the sky. Go, Super Buster, go! You can catch him. Oh no, bad guy Bandit is aiming at Super Buster with his laser shapes. But Super Buster is too fast. Wow, look at him go. Hooray, Super Buster has saved the picnic. But what is that? It's a giant blue laser ball. Oh no, what is Super Buster going to do? Aha! He's using the flagpole as a bat. Bring it on, bad guy bandit. Great shot, Super Buster. What? <laughs> wow, that was such a fun game. But oh no, they've made a huge mess. And Mommy Bus and Grandpa are on their way. What are they going to do? Quick, they've got to clear it up. As superheroes, of course. Super Buster and Bad Guy Bandit are clearing up the city. Even superheroes need to clean up after themselves. Just in time. Great teamwork, guys. <laughs> yum, yum. Delicious. And all that superhero work has left them very hungry. It's a sunny day at Buster's house. And Buster and Grandpa are having a great time playing together. Mommy Bus is off to work. Will Buster and Grandpa be able to make dinner together? Whoa, some real cooking. Buster is very excited. Let's cook. Grandpa sets up the stove. Hmm, but what comes next? Buster has an idea. It's chocolate sauce. Hmm, Grandpa doesn't think that's quite right for dinner. Let's take a look at the recipe. They've gathered all the ingredients together. Buster starts by adding some flour to the bowl. Whoa, easy there, Buster. Oops, the flour has gone everywhere. Now Grandpa and Buster are covered in flour. Buster is adding the finishing touches to the mixture. Careful the mixture doesn't go everywhere. Great job, Buster. Oops, Grandpa's tomato sauce has splattered all over the floor. And what's going on at the stove? The pot is bubbling over. Oh look, it steamed up his glasses and now he can't see where he's going. Watch out, Grandpa. Oh dear, this isn't going very well. Grandpa and Buster are clearing up the mess. But Mommy Bus is coming home from work. Uh-oh, they still haven't made dinner. What are they going to do? Grandpa gets some fish fingers out of the freezer. Aha, this gives Buster an idea. Time for chocolate sauce. Mommy Bus is wondering what Buster and Grandpa have made for dinner, just as they're finishing up. I wonder what they've cooked. It's fish fingers and green beans. And chocolate sauce. Are you sure about this, Buster? He gives it a try. Hmm, delicious. Mommy also gives it a try. And it's surprisingly tasty. Well done, Buster. Buster is at Daddy's house today. Oh, look, it's Daddy Bus. Tomorrow, Buster is going back to school. It's going to be great. But first, they need to get ready. Daddy Bus has a checklist of everything Buster needs before he goes back to school tomorrow. 
He needs his rucksack, a lunchbox, his school book, a pencil case, and a ruler. Hmm. Rucksack, <laughs> check. Lunchbox, check. Everything else, check. And last but not least, the shark tooth from his holiday for show and tell. Wow! Buster needs to get a good night's sleep before school tomorrow. Good night, Buster. There goes the alarm. It must be time to get up. Oh no, Buster has gone back to sleep. Oh dear. And now he's going to be late for school. Quick, they've got to get everything ready. Huh? What does Buster need? Rucksack, check. Lunchbox, check. Pencil case and school book, check. But what is he missing? The ruler. Aha! There it is! It's time to head off for school. Wait a second. Buster forgot his shark tooth. Quick, Buster, quick! Shark tooth, check. They're going to have to race to get there on time. Go, Buster! Looks like the teacher is getting worried. All his friends are already at school and he's going to be late. Oh no! Phew, he did it, just in time. What a crazy morning. Look, it's Bandit. He's coming over to visit Buster today. Bandit is so excited, I wonder why. Wow, what a cool dinosaur, Buster. And Bandit has one too. <laughs> They're off to play at the park. They're having so much fun playing with their dinosaur toys. But wait, what's that? Could it be a dinosaur? Buster and Bandit are using their imaginations to pretend they're on a dinosaur adventure. What was that? It's a T-Rex! Run! Go, go, go! How will they get across? Quick, the dinosaur is coming! Aha! Buster has his cowboy lasso! Go, Buster! But Bandit is a bit nervous! Come on, Bandit! You can do it! Bandit is facing his fears! Woo! Good job, Bandit! There's no way the T-Rex can reach them over here! Uh-oh. Or maybe it can. Look, they can hide behind that tree. Quick, Bandit. Wait a second. An egg? Oh, the T-Rex wasn't chasing them after all. It was looking for its egg. Oh, no. It's heading towards that cliff! Quick, Buster! Phew! Huh? 
<laughs> the egg is safe now. The dinosaur is so grateful to Buster. <laughs> what a fun game. And it wasn't really a dinosaur. It was just Diggly, and he was looking for his ball. <laughs> Everyone loves playing dinosaurs. <laughs> Roar! Roar! <laughs> what a fantastic day playing at the park. Daddy Bus is taking Buster, Bandit, and Scout on a camping trip in the woods. It's time to set up the campsite. First, they've got to put up their tents. Yay! Daddy is showing them how. He's hammering in the pegs to stop the tent from blowing away. Look, they are keeping the tent in place. Hmm. Aha! All done! Whilst Daddy Bus collects wood for the fire, Buster and his friends are finishing their tents. <gasps> what was that? <laughs> Bandit has some marshmallows. <gasps> Yummy! <gasps> oh no! Buster didn't hammer the pegs in properly. The tent has come loose. He can't see a thing. Watch out, Scout! Uh oh, it's blowing away. Will Buster be able to catch it? Scout and Bandit join in to help. Go, Buster! You can do it! Aha! It's finally fallen to the ground. Oh dear, not again! Daddy Bus, look out! Oops! The firewood has gone flying! Oh! Oh! Hmm! He's okay! Time to finally put the tent up! Let's make sure all the pegs are in this time, Buster! Great job! I wonder what Daddy Bus has planned next. Wow! They're roasting marshmallows. Mmm, delicious! What a brilliant day! Buster is having fun splashing in some very muddy puddles outside his house. Look, it's Grandpa Bus. Oops, now they're both covered in mud. But Grandpa has a plan. Where's he taking Buster? They're at the car wash to get cleaned up. Hooray! It looks like the car wash is all out of bubbles. Aha! There's the soap. Grandpa adds a small squirt. And Buster turns on the car wash. Go, Buster, go! Hang on. That's a lot of soap, Grandpa Bus. <laughs> Buster is covered in soapy bubbles. How funny. That was a very good joke, Grandpa. Now it's Grandpa's turn to get cleaned up. Looks like Buster's got a plan. He's getting his own back. Grandpa is covered in soap. He looks very silly. Look, Terry the tractor is here for a wash. Whoa, go easy, Buster. The bubbles are overflowing. Oh dear, what a soapy mess. Otis doesn't look very happy. Time to clear up the mess. What a silly day. It's Halloween. Ash and Scout are at Buster's house, ready to go trick-or-treating. Whoa, that zombie costume looks amazing. Bandit is not impressed. Boo! Nope, Bandit doesn't want to join in. He thinks dressing up is for babies. 
Buster, Scout, and Ash head off on their trick-or-treating adventure. Hang on, Bandit would really like some Halloween sweets. <gasps> Looks like he's got an idea. <gasps> Bandit has copied Buster's costume. They look exactly the same. He's arrived at Terry's farm looking like Buster. <laughs> Trick or treat? Wow, look at all those sweeties. Oh look, Buster, Ash, and Scout have arrived. Some sweeties for Scout? Some sweeties for Ash? Hang on. Nope, Terry thinks he's already given Buster lots of sweets, but it was actually Naughty Bandit. Poor Buster. Ash and Scout like how they look in their reflections. What is that? A sweet wrapper? And another? It's Bandit eating all the sweets! Buster has a plan. Ash and Scout are pretending to think that Bandit is Buster. Bandit is looking at himself in the reflection. Wait a second, now there are two bandits! Bandit is a bit confused and a bit scared. Where have the others gone? Boo! Buster's plan worked. Bandit has been caught in the act. And here's Terry with more sweets. He's confused by the two zombies. He's given them to Bandit again. But Bandit is sharing it with Buster. <laughs> what a funny mix-up. Happy Halloween! Buster, Mommy Bus, and Ash are at the Soft Play Center. How exciting! Looks like Buster wants to play in the big kids section, but he's not quite big enough yet. Wow, this is amazing! Ash is very excited, but Buster thinks he's too old for soft play. They're having so much fun! Look at them go! But Buster doesn't want to join. Now they're bouncing on the trampoline! Whee! That does look like lots of fun, Buster! Nope, he's still not going to play. What is Ash running from? Oh look, it's Captain Mommy! Arg! Quick, run away, Ash! He's escaped to the ball pit. That looks like so much fun! Now Buster wants to join in. Quick, the captain is going to catch you! Go, Buster! Buster is really getting into this now! Ahoy, me hearties! <gasps> what was that? <laughs> gotcha! It's Pirate Buster and Pirate Ash to the rescue! Run away! <laughs> Look at them go! Watch out, Captain Mommy! Pirate Buster and Pirate Ash have saved the day! See, Buster? The soft play center was lots of fun after all! Buster and his friends are on a holiday at the beach! What a fun day out! Wow! The sea looks amazing! What is that in the water? Ah! It's a shark! Buster is very scared! 
Oops! Watch out, Iggy! <laughs> Mommy Bus is taking a nap on the beach. Buster is trying to tell her what he saw. It had scary fins and jumped out of the water. It was a shark. Hmm. Hmm. Mommy Bus can't see anything. Don't worry, Buster. Everything is fine. And Mommy Bus is going back to her nap. Buster is still very scared. I wonder if the shark is still there. Ah! It's a shark! Go, Buster, go! Oops! Not again! Buster is still frightened, but he wants to get over his fear. He's going back again. There's the shark. Wait a second, what's wrong? The shark has a sore, wobbly tooth. That's why it was jumping out of the water. Don't worry, shark. Buster can help. He's trying to get Mommy's attention. She's awake. She's got her red kit and Mommy Bus to the rescue. Splat! <laughs> yum, yum! Mommy Bus is removing the shark's wobbly tooth. It's out! Hooray! The shark feels so much better now. Well done, Buster! He can't wait to show the tooth to his friends. It's Buster's birthday! Mommy and Grandpa are setting up a very special party. Don't eat the food yet, Buster. You've got to wait until your guests arrive. Oh, look, here they are! It's Scout, Ash, and Bandit. Everyone's so excited for the party. What's Bandit up to? Hmm, that cake looks yummy. Not yet, Bandit. First, we're playing party games. They're playing musical statues. They have to dance until the music stops. Great move, Scout. And freeze. Oh no, Scout is losing balance. And so is Buster. They are out of the game. It's only Bandit and Ash left. And dance! <laughs> Bandit is losing balance! Oh no! He knocked Ash over so he could win. And now Ash is out of the game. But Grandpa didn't see Bandit cheating. Hmm, that wasn't very nice, Bandit. Now they're playing past the parcel. They pass the present, and when the music stops, they can take off the wrapping paper. Oh. Hooray for Ash! <gasps> Bandit has cheated again! He took the parcel after the music stopped. <laughs> Poor Ash! <laughs> Bandit isn't playing very fair. Buster is telling Bandit that he's making Ash feel upset. He needs to think about how his actions affect the feelings of others. It's time for some birthday cake! Blow out the candles! Go, Buster! What a feast! All the delicious food has been eaten. Well, almost. Don't worry, Ash. Have some birthday cake. Bandit feels really bad for making Ash sad. Bandit is really sorry and gives Ash his ball back. It's okay, Bandit. Ash forgives you. But remember, it's not all about the winning. It's about having fun together. Buster's kindness saved the party. Happy birthday, Buster! Buster is excited to spend the day with Grandpa. And Grandpa's looking at a beautiful cake. 
<laughs> Grandpa has an idea. They should bake the cake together. Buster and Grandpa have come to the supermarket to get the ingredients. Flour, eggs, milk, and icing sugar. Uh. <laughs> Oop. Who's that? It's Mira! <laughs> Along with Terry. Buster rushes to get the ingredients. But Grandpa warns him not to be hasty. Buster's looking for flour. Bingo! He's found it! And so has Mira. Uh-oh. Looks like they've got the same list of ingredients. Whoa, they both want the same bag. Oops. Mira and Buster are in the race to find out who gets all the ingredients first. Buster's come to get the milk. He got it first. Off he goes, Mira. Whoops. Mira, you spooked the teacher. <laughs> she grabbed some milk, too. Slow down, you guys. Whoa! It's Grandpa and Terry. Both of them move very slowly. You sure are smart and sly, Buster. Off they go again. Oh, look! There are the eggs. Oh no, Buster dropped the eggs. And Mira spotted the last bag of icing sugar. Mira sprints off to get it. But oh no, Mira lost balance and crashed into the shelf. Buster grabs the last bag of icing sugar. But Mira's upset. Buster offers her the icing sugar, and she wants him to have it. Grandpa and Terry are surprised to see Mira in a mess. Buster's got a plan. Aw, looks like Buster and Mira shared the icing sugar to bake one big cake. The cake tastes delicious. Great teamwork, Mira and Buster. <laughs> Daddy Bus and Buster are driving across the hills. Oh, look! It's a baby deer. What's it running from? Huh? It's Trax in the train. Oh, no. What's wrong? Traxon can't stop. Quick! Buster and Daddy Bus to the rescue. Oh, no. He's speeding up. Daddy Bus is calling Otis the police car. This is an emergency. Ah, there's a branch on the tracks. Daddy Bus swoops in and moves it. Hooray! Well done, Daddy Bus. Looks like the tracks change directions up ahead. Daddy Bus and Buster are pulling the levers to change the direction of the tracks. But, oh no! Terry is crossing the tracks! Change them, quick! That was close! Now Traxon is going round and round. He's getting dizzy! Oh no! Watch out! Phew! Daddy was just in time. Looks like Buster has a plan. They need to direct Traxon towards the hill. The hill is slowing him down. He stopped! Hooray! Go, Buster! <laughs> Otis has arrived on the scene. This doesn't look like an emergency. Oops. 
Daddy Bus is reading a book about wildlife. There are so many amazing animals. Bah! What was that? Buster's taking photos with his new camera. <laughs> what a silly picture, Daddy. <gasps> it's given Daddy an idea. Daddy Bus and Buster are on a wildlife scavenger hunt to find this red and blue butterfly. Wow! Buster is determined to find it. <gasps> there it is! Buster, behind you! Oh no, they didn't see it! Maybe the butterfly is hiding in that long grass? <laughs> Let's check it out! Oh look, Buster has spotted something! <laughs> Snap! Wait a second. It wasn't the red butterfly. It was Ash the fire truck with his mommy. Buster takes a photo for them. What a nice thing to do, Buster. Buster, look up! Quick! There's the butterfly! Oh no, he missed it again! <laughs> Aha! Buster knows where they should look next. Maybe the butterfly will be by the lake. Hmm. There it is! There's the butterfly! Steady, Buster. Don't scare it away. Oh no! Don't worry, Buster. You just have to be patient. What's that? It's red and blue. Oh no, not again. It was just teacher's red bow tie. It's a great photo though, Buster. Mm. Poor Buster. He's upset he hasn't found the butterfly yet. It's okay, Buster. You just need to be patient. <gasps> There it is! Buster, look up! Buster, look up! <laughs> That's it. Take a deep breath and be patient. He's getting some amazing photos of all the wildlife. <gasps> There's the butterfly! <gasps> Quick! Go, Buster! He finally managed to get the photo, and it was definitely worth the wait. Buster and his friends are having a great time camping in the woods with Daddy Bus. Daddy is making some spooky shadows as he tells them a ghost story. Whoa, that monster is super scary! Phew! Don't worry, gang. It's only Daddy Bus. Looks like it's time for bed. Good night, everyone. Daddy Bus is off to collect some more firewood for the fire. Good night, Buster. Hang on. What is Buster up to? He's turning the firewood into scary antlers. Scout is fast asleep. Yikes! What is that? <gasps> it's Buster's scary shadow! Poor Scout! <laughs> Don't worry, Scout. It was only Buster. <laughs> now it's Bandit's turn to be pranked. Aha! The spooky shadow scared him as well. Looks like Buster is getting sleepy. But Bandit and Scout have a plan. Buster is sleeping peacefully. But there's a scary monster! And another one! Go, Buster, go! That served Buster right. Great job, gang. What is that? Oh, no! It's a real spooky monster! Phew! It was just Daddy Bus carrying back more firewood. That's enough scaring for one evening. 
all that joking around has made them very tired. It's a sunny day in the school playground, and Buster and Scout are drawing together. Uh-oh, looks like they both want the blue crayon. Buster snatches it, and now Scout is trying to snatch it back. It's given Buster and Bandit a great idea for a game they can all play together. <laughs> Using their imaginations. <laughs> it's cops and robbers. Buster and Bandit are the robbers. And Ash and Scout are the cops trying to catch them. Off they go, the chase is on. Buster and Bandit are splitting up. Oh no, Bandit is cornered. Aha, he's got a plan. Where has he gone? Hang on a second, that fox is moving. Quick, Ash, you can catch him. He's jumping off that ramp. Go, Buster! I wonder if Buster and Bandit are going to escape. They're all getting very close. Whoa, watch out! Buster and Bandit have driven straight into jail. Hooray for the cops, Scout, and Ash. Time to give up the crayon, Buster. That was fantastic. What a brilliant game. Now Scout can finally finish off her drawing. Buster and Bandit are free to go. What a fantastic playtime, everyone! Buster, Bandit, and Mira are outside playing with their soccer ball. Daddy Bus is fishing. <sighs> he hasn't caught any fish yet. Buster has some great skills. Whoa, and so does Mira. That's a big kick, Bandit. Watch out, Mira. Oh no, the ball knocked Mira's hat off. Where did it go? It's not over here. It's definitely not over there. Mira is upset that her favorite hat is missing. Don't worry, Mira. We'll help you find it. Buster has an idea. We can look for the hat using our imagination. Now we can turn the search into a fun game. Off they go. It's time to look for that hat. Whoa, those are very big footprints. They decide to follow them and see where they go. Stop. What's that up ahead? <gasps> it's a dinosaur! And he's wearing Mira's hat! Uh-oh! Run! They're going as fast as they can, but the dinosaur isn't far behind. And Buster spots a big volcano up ahead. They've got to get over that puddle. Buster and Mira make it, but oh no! Bandit gets stuck! Buster is trying to help Bandit get out. <gasps> Uh-oh! The dinosaur caught up with them! He looks very scary! But what's the dinosaur doing? He's seen his reflection! And I think he likes the hat. But that's Mira's hat, and she wants it back. Looks like she has an idea. <laughs> wow! Nice shot, Mira! The ball knocked the hat right off! Oh no! But looks like the hat is flying straight towards the volcano! How are they going to get it back now? Buster can do it using his imagination! It's Super Buster! Off he flies to save the hat! It's getting closer and closer to the volcano! He needs to be quick! Go, Buster! He got it! Buster, you're a great friend. They played a fun game, and Mira got her favorite hat back. 
Everything is more fun when you use your imagination. Buster and Mommy Bus are visiting Terry's farm today. Wow, the farm is so cool. Buster is so excited. Oh, look, an adorable litter of puppies. How cute. Buster has spotted a soccer ball. He loves soccer. <laughs> Mommy Bus is here to check that all the puppies are healthy, but Buster has other ideas. He wants to go and play some soccer on the farm. <laughs> what was that? One of the puppies followed Buster outside. Looks like she wants to play. Hmm, but Buster wants to play by himself. There she is again. The puppy won't stop following him. Buster is throwing the puppy a stick to distract her. That will make her leave. Nope, that didn't work. And now the puppy has taken the soccer ball. What a cheeky little puppy. Aha! Finally Buster got his ball back. But the puppy still wants to play. Stay there, puppy. Buster is hiding behind a stack of hay bales. <gasps> Not again! Maybe Buster can lose the puppy in the cornfield. The puppy is sad she can't find him. But Buster's plan worked. Oh no! How did that puppy get up there? She's going to fall! <gasps> And Mommy Bus and Terry haven't noticed. <laughs> quick, Buster, quick! Go, Buster! Phew! He saved the puppy! That was a close one! Oh. Mommy Bus has noticed a puppy is missing. But don't worry, Buster has brought her home. <laughs> what a fun day at the farm! Uh-oh, not again! Buster and his friends are at school. And today, they have a very special visitor. It's Mommy Fire Truck! Hooray! She's here to show them what a fire truck does. When a building is on fire, you have to call a firefighter as quick as you can. What happens next? A hose is attached to a water hydrant and the water puts out the fire! Yippee! It's time to practice! They have to knock the cones over with a jet of water. Ash is first! Yay! Well done, Ash! And Scouse? Oops. That's better. Well done! Now it's Buster's turn. Wow! Watch out, Buster! That was a great day. But now Mommy Fire Truck needs to get to work. Goodbye, Mommy Fire Truck. Thank you! Now it's the end of the day, and Buster is heading home. Bye, Scout. Bye, Ash. <gasps> what is that? It's smoke. Where could it be coming from? <gasps> oh no, it's a fire. What should Buster do? He needs a firefighter. 
Buster is getting Mommy Fire Truck to help. <gasps> Teacher will take care of Ash. Go, Mommy, go! <gasps> there's the fire. Aha! And there's a water hydrant. Next step, attach the hose. Oh no! Quick! Phew! The fire is out! Yippee! What great teamwork! It's the next day at school! Teacher is calling Buster up to the front! What could it be for? Look! Mommy Fire Truck! She's here to thank Buster for all his help and award him with a special fire truck hat! Go, Buster! It's Halloween and Buster is at Daddy's house! Oh, but Halloween can be scary! Daddy Bus has an idea! He's going to tell a Halloween story! Daddy's going to tell a story of the brave wizard's adventure to find the magic gems and save Halloween. Buster the brave wizard went on an adventure. He had to find all the magic gems. There must be gems in that castle. They're guarded by a monster. <laughs> This wizard must be very brave, Dad. <sighs> the wizard was the bravest of all, Buster! <laughs> ah. <laughs> the hero presses on through the dark woods towards the castle. <laughs> Something stirs in the darkness up ahead in the forest. What is it, Dad? A werewolf? <gasps> A ghost? A were-ghost! <laughs> The mysterious shadow grows larger. Is it the monster? <laughs> he found a jewel. Well done. <laughs> Finally, the wizard reached the mysterious castle. There must be more gems inside, huh? but how to get there? He needs to lower the drawbridge, but how? The wizard could use his magic! <laughs> Good idea! The brave adventurer pushed forward inside the castle walls. Onward, into the castle! How brave the wizard is! What will our hero do? Run huh? or continue? Continue, continue! Ooh. The wizard has to find the treasure and save Halloween! <laughs> but what's that behind them? It's the monster! Ah! If the wizard wants to get those magic jewels, he'll need to get past it. Wait, Daddy. The monster must be really lonely. Oh, I suppose so, yes. The monster is lonely. Maybe the wizard should help the monster. He needs a friend. And so the brave wizard rolled up and used his magic to make the castle all warm and bright. <laughs> the monster is you, Dad. <laughs> the monster was so grateful he gave the wizard all the magic jewels. So brave Buster <laughs> saved Halloween for everyone. Buster is heading off to school. Wait a second, Buster. Don't forget, it's school photo day today. So you need an extra polish. Bye, Mommy Bus. Look! Terry Tractor is here to take the school photos. Bandit and Ash are up first. Smile! Buster's turn next. And he wants to get an action shot. Whoops! Buster slipped! Watch out, Scout! Oh no, what's wrong? 
the teacher is handing Buster a mirror. <gasps> Buster has knocked out his wobbly front tooth. Oh, no. And now Buster is too embarrassed to have his photo taken. It's okay, Buster. You can have it taken another day. Buster is feeling really sad about missing out on the photos. But Mommy Bus is here to pick him up. And she's taking him to the dentist to get his tooth looked at. Hooray! Buster is a little bit nervous. Don't worry, Buster. Amber the ambulance is here to take a look at that tooth for you. It's time to sit in the special dentist chair. Wow, that looks like so much fun! And now it's time to check that tooth. Don't worry, Buster. There's nothing to be scared of. First, Amber is looking at the tooth with a little mirror. Open wide, Buster. Say, ah! Uh. And what's that? Amber's going to play Buster a video. It's another bus, just like Buster. <laughs> and his tooth has fallen out. But don't worry, another one will grow in its place. He might be missing a tooth for now, but soon he'll have a brand new one. So there's nothing to be embarrassed about. Buster now feels much better. Thanks, Amber. <laughs> And now he's going back to school to get his photo taken. <laughs> Gather in, Buster. Yeah. Say cheese. Daddy Bus and Buster are visiting the river today. What are they going to get up to? Oh, boats. How exciting. Buster wants to ride the boat. But wait. Not yet. First, Daddy Bus wants to teach Buster how to tie a strong knot so the boat doesn't float away. Daddy Bus has tied a great knot. Now it's Buster's turn. Aw, nearly there. That's okay, Buster. Tying strong knots is really hard. Daddy Bus is going to show Buster how to do it again. But Buster isn't very interested in tying knots. Hmm, the boat is right there. And Daddy is concentrating very hard on his knot. Buster's off. This is much more fun. Oh no, the boat wasn't tied to the dock. The river is carrying Buster away. Buster's trying to paddle back, but he can't seem to steer. Daddy Bus to the rescue. Uh-oh, that boat has a leak. He needs to find another way. Buster is floating even further down the river. Careful, Daddy Bus. What's Buster going to do? Oh, there's a bridge. Buster is grabbing on. Phew. Oh no, the pole broke off. Daddy Bus just missed him. Look out! Uh-oh. Buster has spotted rocks ahead. But he can use the wooden pole to steer away from them. It's working! Good thinking, Buster. Oh no, the pole snapped! And look, a waterfall ahead! What's Daddy pointing to? A rope! Perfect! The waterfall isn't far away now. You can do it! Go, Buster! Nice throw! Daddy Bus is pulling Buster back to the shore. Nearly there. Just a bit further. Phew! Back on dry land. Now Buster and Daddy are fishing instead. That's 
it's much more relaxing. <laughs> it's Halloween, and Buster is having a party. He's looking for a cool costume to make himself super scary. What has he found? Whoa! Buster is dressed up as a cowboy! Awesome! Time to put this costume to the test. Boo! Buster tries to scare Mommy. Did it work? Hmm, maybe the cowboy costume isn't scary enough. He needs to find something scarier. Aha! He's got it! Arr! He's a pirate! This is going to be much scarier. Oops! Be careful, Buster! There's Grandpa Bus! Scare him, Buster! Arr! Oh dear! Buster is still not scary enough! But looks like he's got an idea. Hang on a second. Where has Grandpa's laundry gone? It's time for snacks. <laughs> what was that? There's a noise coming from that shed. But what is making that noise? It's a bit spooky. Wait a second, I recognize that giggle. It was Buster all along. That was definitely a scary costume. Sounds like people have arrived for the party. And Mommy has a plan. Ash and Scout have arrived. They're so excited. Hmm. There's nobody there. Whoa. They're a little oh. bit scared. <gasps> what is that? Mm. Boo! <gasps> ah! Run away! <laughs> Don't worry, Ash and Scout. It was just Buster. <laughs> what a great prank and a very scary <laughs> costume. <laughs> Buster is packing his bag for Ash's birthday picnic. He will need a picnic blanket, something to drink. What else does Buster need? Marshmallows to toast on the fire! Thanks, Daddy Bus! Don't forget Ash's present! Buster is so excited to celebrate Ash's birthday. What's wrong, Buster? He looks a bit unwell. He really doesn't want to miss the party. Buster and Daddy have arrived. Time to play some party games together. Hmm, Buster really doesn't look well. But he doesn't want to miss out on the fun. They're playing hide and seek. Oh no, Buster is feeling really poorly. Maybe sitting by the fire will make him feel better? His friends are worried about him and want to make sure he's okay. Maybe some marshmallows will make him feel better. He can't even eat toasted marshmallows. Daddy Bus is taking Buster home to rest. But he can't forget Ash's birthday present. What is it? It's a painting set. That's very thoughtful, Buster. Ah. 
It's given Ash an idea! He's passing a paintbrush to Bandit and Scout! I wonder what they're going to paint! Buster is resting at home. He isn't his usual happy self. He needs to take his medicine and get some sleep to feel better. Well done, Buster. The next day, Buster is feeling a bit better now. But he's still sad he missed Ash's birthday. Daddy Bus has got Buster some warm soup. And what's that? His friends made a painting for him. And they're outside! Hooray! Buster is so happy to see his friends. And the painting has made him feel much better. Buster and Ash are on holiday at the beach. Mommy Bus and Mommy Fire Truck are preparing a barbecue. And Buster and Ash are building an amazing sand castle. Whoa, those waves are really coming in. Quick, the sand castle could be ruined. Ash to the rescue. He's protecting the castle with a wall of sand. Great idea, Ash. Oh, look, it's Iggy, the ice cream truck. Hooray! Oh, no! Ash's wall couldn't stop the waves. They've ruined their sand castle. Buster is very sad. But Ash has got a plan to save it. Buster is too upset to help. Maybe an ice cream will cheer him up. I wonder what flavors he'll choose. Wow, that's a huge ice cream. Whoa, steady! Ash is still fixing the sand castle. Buster could get Ash an ice cream too, but he's upset with Ash because his wall didn't protect the sand castle. Buster's only getting ice cream for himself. Whoa! Ash has rebuilt the sand castle. Good as new! Buster now feels bad he didn't get Ash an ice cream, so he's giving Ash his. Be careful, don't drop it. Iggy gives them another cone. Now they can share the ice cream. Yum, yum, delicious. I wonder what Buster's going to learn at school today. Oh, a volcano. Wow. They're going to do an experiment. The teacher is showing them what to do. First, a drop of white powder. Then three drops of food coloring. Then some vinegar to make it all bubbly. Wow, it looks like an erupting volcano. Isn't that amazing? Everyone is so excited. They're going to do the experiment all by themselves. What a mess. It looks like Bandit didn't do it right. Oh no! Scouts didn't go right either. Maybe Buster? Buster has made just as much mess as the others. Why isn't it working? Can Ash get it right? Buster is going to check. Ash is still putting ingredients in. Whoa! It worked! Nice work, Ash! But how did Ash get it right when everyone else's went wrong? Oh, he followed the instructions on the board! What a good idea! The teacher is proud of Ash. Now the others are going to try again. But first, they check what they need to do. One drop of white powder. Then three drops of food coloring. <laughs> then some vinegar to make it all bubbly. <laughs> Hooray! It's working! The volcanoes are all bubbling over. Don't they look great? Good job, everyone! 
It's amazing what you can do when you follow the instructions. The teacher is so proud of everyone. Buster is having so much fun playing on his drum kit. Oops, there goes a drumstick. It's rolling over to Mommy. Hmm, what's Mommy doing? Oh, she's clearing out all Buster's old toys. The ones he doesn't use anymore. I wonder what's inside. Look, Buster's baby drum. He remembers that. Mommy is going to recycle it so someone else can enjoy it. Buster is sad. But he has a bigger, better drum kit now. But Buster wants to keep his little drum. He doesn't like to let go. Here's Scout with her tambourine. She's come round to play. Hooray! Time to make some music. Buster and Scout are ready to play. And here's Ash, too. He's come to listen. Now Buster and Scout have an audience. They're ready to rock. One, two, three, four. Nice. Buster and Scout are really grooving. Nice work, guys. Scout shakes the tambourine. Buster bangs the drums. Oh, he's trying to play his little drum at the same time. That doesn't work so well. He's trying to do too much at once. Oops. Aw, Ash wants to join in. But he doesn't have an instrument. And Buster has one too many. What's he going to do? Buster is giving his little drum to Ash to play. Now Ash can play along. And all three of them can have fun. Ready? One, two, three, four! There! That sounds even better than before! At the end of the day, Ash is going to give the drum back. But Buster knows he doesn't need two drums. He wants Ash to keep it. Ash is so happy! What a kind thing Buster did! Buster looks so excited! I wonder why! A storybook! Buster wants Mommy to read to him! Buster loves a good fairy tale! Mommy's reading Buster the story of Goldilocks and the Three Bears! When the bears had gone out, Goldilocks came to the window. She tried their porridge, but the first bowl was too hot! Buster thinks that's very funny! But look at the time! Mommy can't read all day! Buster's upset. He wants to know what happens next in the story. But Mommy knows what to do. Maybe Grandpa can read to Buster? Grandpa is out watering the plants. But Buster wants him to read more of the storybook. Yes, Grandpa can read to him for a bit. He loves stories of great adventures and brave heroes. What's happening now? Goldilocks sits on a chair that's too small, and it breaks! How funny! Buster loves this story. But what's this? Mommy says it's time for dinner. The rest of the story will have to wait. Buster has some nice fish fingers and vegetables for dinner. But he's eating them all really fast. He wants to get back to the story as soon as possible. Hmm, Mommy and Grandpa are still eating. They can't read to him right now. Buster really wants to know what happens next. Look, he's trying to read it himself. He's not very good at reading, but he's trying really hard. Wow, he's getting it. Mommy and Grandpa are so proud of him. Good job, Buster. But oh dear, he's getting sleepy too. Mommy's reading the book to Buster as a bedtime story. Now Goldilocks is asleep in the bear's bed. Oh, look, Buster has fallen asleep. Aw, he'd had such a busy day, he couldn't stay awake for the end. Good night, Buster. Buster and his friends look so excited. What's going on? Oh, wow, Mommy has set up an Easter egg hunt for them. What's that? I think Scout is really excited about having some yummy chocolate. Ready and go! Everyone's going to look for the Easter eggs. Oops! Try not to bump into each other. Nice! Ash found an egg in that tree. He's rushing back and putting it in the basket so they can all share it later. Good job, Ash! Ooh, I think Buster has seen an egg too. 
Wait, this is just the wrapping paper. Where's the chocolate egg gone? Buster's disappointed. But look, there's another egg by the bush. Hmm, this one's just wrapping too. Someone has taken the chocolate. Very strange. Oh dear, Ash is worried. They haven't found enough eggs to share around. But it's okay, they'll just have to keep looking. What's this? Another empty bit of wrapping. There's Bandit. He's sneaky. Maybe he's been stealing all the chocolate? He's got some eggs. But look, he's putting them in the basket. It's not Bandit who's stealing them. Look, there goes Scout. She'll know what to do. But wait. Is that chocolate around Scout's mouth? She's the one stealing all the eggs. Look, Scout hid all the eggs she found behind that bush. She loves chocolate so much, she wanted them all to herself. But she's very sorry. She knows sharing is the right thing to do. Buster forgives her, but they'd better clean that chocolate off her face. There, Mommy can share them out equally. Ash, Bandit, Buster, Scout. Everyone gets some yummy Easter eggs.